This young orca from Lagos succeeded in scamming Nigeria popular commedia Brin Jota. Succeeded in scamming international superstar Davido and his entire family, their delicate family, and the Ushu State Governor. Succeeded in scamming Nigerians and the general public who cared about the hawker. Apparently, she is a he and not a she. He dresses like a lady, like a girl, to hawk pure water and bottle water in Lagos Street. Well, I'm going to be narrating all the story to you guys. Brain Jota was cruising around Lagos as a day before yesterday. That is on the 7th, 7th of this month, November. And they came across this very young orca, a girl. He was drawn to her because he saw, he saw her as an, as an avenue to educate, to support, to motivate other people who are sitting at home. Because in this world, he's saying, look at this girl. If this girl that is uh, disabled can go out to hustle, can go out to hug pure water with a disabled hand, what are you doing at home, doing nothing, and expecting manner to fall from heaven? He was using the girl as a point of motivation to other people sitting at home, but not knowing that's a girl's business. And sorry, I'm, I'm confusing myself. She's not a girl. She's a boy. But maybe he thought that, okay, boys do not easily get help. So I have to transit to become a woman in order to get help, just like Bob Risky and uh, James Brown and every other cross-dresser who, who is trying to transit to become a woman. And he actually worked for them. They get a lot of uh, offers. But we are not discussing about that. So after Brain Jota was deceived, sent this girl the sum of 400,000 Naira, and also promoted the girl's business because the girl, the author said that she has a makeup studio. So, also promoting the author's business, David Doe was attracted to this girl. And David Doe immediately contacted Oshu State Governor, who is also a delegate because the girl said she's from Oshu State. Contacted Oshu State Governor to immediately assist this girl, and Oshu State Governor replied immediately. Oshu State said, the Governor said, he has directed his personnel to look for this girl and her sister in any capacity she wants, be it education or be it business. They are willing to assist her. But guess what? An NGO came out yesterday to say, this girl, she's a scammer. And she's not even a girl. She's a boy who dresses like a girl. <laughs> well, I'm going to play a video from uh, Brain Jota. Then I'm going to show you other evidence as well. This is the one from Brain Jota. Beg everybody, oh, yeah. see this girl. See who they sell water. Oh, no, they see her. Thank you, show your face. Why are you doing that? They see person they sell water. Before you go come, DM, come they shout, say you have not eaten since morning. I'm a Mr. Yeah. Party, so my name you is Plan Bayenola, Mr. Brown. Ah, your name is what? Plan Bayenola, Mr. Brown. You be makeup artist? Yes, I'm a makeup artist. Are you serious? I don't get support, that's why I'm selling bottles water inside traffic. In the era, that's why she they do it, she they sell bottles water, she not a beggar. Before you go call, they tell me, say, you have not eaten since morning. You understand? Me. They say, I have class. Follow me, I'm a makeup artist. Drop, go drop your bottle water for front. Very good. Before you go oh, begin, oh, we, oh, yeah. we just they drive or oh, they see we just oh, see yeah. the girl. They say bottle water. Look at the girl in front. One hand good. She still use one hand. Oh bottle water. They sell them for express. You understand? Mm. Who want beg go beg? Who want walk go walk? Grace they fall from anywhere. You understand? Yes, so so more see how we go take. And I know you just a be. I did be waiting for her to drop one or two because of time. I to still drop one or two. She said she will make up artists. I will tag her on this video. I will already connect. Must see. Well, Brain Jota was using her as a point of motivation to other people sitting at home. 
that they should come out to hustle and give her the sum of 400,000 naira. <laughs> Sorry, give give him the sum of 400,000 naira to start up and also promoted her business. David Doe was attracted. Immediately contacted Oju State Governor. They rendered an uh, assistant. But as at yesterday, it was discovered that this girl eh, was a real scammer. That's a business. And the videos and the evidence I'm showing you will tell you definitely that she is a scammer. She was contacted by an NGO. In fact, this girl has been getting help ever when she was in school. Because of that disabled hand, she, because of his uh, disabled hand, sorry, contradicting myself because of the, of the story, the boy has been getting help ever since because of his disabled hand. You know, everybody will see him will be like, oh, 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 pity and all those things. Well, according to Jim Slobber, they said, she's a boy. According to the NGO, she's a boy. We got her an apartment in K2 and make up product. Got things in the house. Later, he went back to the street. After warning her to stop scamming people, he will open different page and change location to sell pure water. He's a boy, not a girl. He, he taped his cucumber, wear a padded bra and bonbon to deceive people that he's a girl. That is a lie. We do not know if this this new donation was a plain plan between him and Brain Jota. Or Brain Jota is not aware. She is a boy and not a girl. We donate a lot of money for him only to see him back on the street the next month. Nigeria should not fall for this scam. We have all evidence with us. Dear Nigerians, so now good mind, no go. Uh, kill you now. All these beggars be turning it to a day job. You see, my pain is that the real people who need help eh, won't be able to get help because of this kind of uh, yeah, 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 people. The real people who need help won't be able to get help because of this kind of people. Because of this kind of people. Well, David Doe has immediately, huh, as of today, withdraw himself from the situation. He has again contacted the Oshu state governor. He said that this girl, guy, boy, is a scammer. Do not assist. Oshu state governor has responded that his hand is off the matter. Well, this boy will change location. Or maybe God has decided to, uh, God that nature has decided to punish him. They have assisted you severally. You always want to go back to the street. You always want to go back to the street. He is not the only one doing this kind of job. A lot of beggars are in it currently. You will be so surprised. That beggar you are giving, eh? That beggar you are giving a eh, 500 naira to, eh? As a house. And you, you do not have nothing to your name. You will be so surprised. The beggar you are giving 100 naira to, eh? Can successfully take care of a family. Or have like 20 children at home. This is the reason why... I stop. I'm trying to look for device and means that I can assist people. Honestly, if I want to give anything to any beggar, I will bring food and share it. Provisions, share it. But money, like lie, you are not getting money from me. I will only assist anybody, people who I, I, I know that yeah, they are hustling, I know their business, I know what they are doing. Then I assist them. But beggar, Mostly all those houses are beg all those people. Igbo beggars are all of them join. If you go and give them 1,000 naira, you'll be so surprised. They have 10 children at home. They have four wives. They are constantly knocking one night to another night at home. They are enjoying themselves like big men and big women. Why the women? They are successfully giving birth every time, every time. They don't feel the pain of their suffering. To beg is a sin. Yes, so it's written. Giving is a blessing. But to beg, like you know the kind of begging now. Begging that you become entitled. It's a sin. 
Bridgewater wasn't aware of the situation. In fact, Bridgewater said, if I tell you, say, I know Taya, I deny. Just Negundu, bro, deceive us all. Some people has helped him with over 600k before. He lied. He's a man. Now, this guy, this girl, have, he, he's now aware that everybody now knows about him. Guess what? He's going to run to another location. But guess what? If he turn and catch your face, eh, sorry for you. You know, girl, you run again. Nobody will assist you again. In fact, then you make up business, you don't spoil. Nobody will come do makeup for your hand again. Nothing. Maybe you go put your hand, may go work for Nigeria, except if you decide to go to Ghana to continue the business there. And Ghanaians don't see your face too. If Ghanaians they either catch you, they catch your face, it don't spread to for Ghana. But now you don't spoil your business. Now God catch you. Deceiving people. Deceiving people and robbing people of opportunity. Yes, so she's not he's not just deceiving people, he's robbing others of opportunity of getting assistance. He's not just deceiving people, he's robbing others of opportunity to get assistance. So why will you pity someone who is spoiling other people uh, joy for them? Now, they do not know who to assist. You do not know how to assist the person. You do not know what to do. Before, people will see uh, people in distress along express and they will stop to assist. But right now, right now, <laughs> because of people are devised means to start hurting people because of their uh, good heart, people with good heart do not want to assist anymore. They don't want to assist anymore because they want to they, they don't want to fall victim. The old, people who still assist and we just they sometimes just cross their mind. They'll be like, see, if I give you, I give you. If you like use and do rubbish, that one on your own. My heart I give to you. You know. So let me know exactly how you feel about the entire story of uh, <laughs> the popular disabled hawker who succeeded is coming everybody.